entering the cage first. Please give it up for Shaquille Mia. Okay, next bout of the evening, we have Shaquille Mia versus Fazan Khan. Shaquille Mia is from London, fighting out of Alkawi self defense and Pilsung Taekwondo. Shaquille, his uh, MMA record is 1 0 0. His nickname is the Winter Soldier. Currently fighting out of East London, and he's got background in Taekwondo and Karate. His fighting strength is his striking, and uh, his thoughts are upon another fight is that he wants to put on a good show and he's here to, he hopes his opponent does as well. Uh, what made Shaquille get into fighting was self-improvement. His favourite MMA fighter is Ken Shamrock, the legendary Ken Shamrock. Uh, his goals and ambitions in MMA are just basically improve himself as a fighter and you know, see, us fight, see how far he can go into the sport. And now, entering the cage, his opponent, please give it up for Farzan so Khan. Farzan Khan. So, uh, just looking at Farzan's record here, he's making his debut. He's fighting out of Ultimate Athlete Newton with a background of uh, BJJ and Muay Thai. Uh, his strengths are his ground game. And just looking through his resume here, his, his favourite fighters are the GSB, Fedor, Kogan and Khabib. And that's a quite, quite a roster of fighters to, to look up to. And uh, what are his ambitions? Is to be a UFC champion. Wow. So uh, I'm looking forward to this. Yep, amazing, amazing ambitions there for Zion Khan. Now, uh, let's not forget, you know, he, he comes from a good camp. You know, Jason Radcliffe, his head coach, uh, also uh, uh, professional MMA fighter on the UK fight circuit. Um, so I'm sure he's, uh, he's had a, a lot of good training from Jason, I'm sure of that. Absolutely, and the, and the ultimate athlete will be the new team. And uh, I'm not here to have a lot of good fights and down to some of So, I mean, this guy's going to work quite well. Yeah, I mean, it looks like they've, you know, they've, they've, they've put the... Um, yeah, to get the right people around there, Jim. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is a featherweight MMA battle. Introducing our two warriors first. Fighting out of the blue corner. Representing Alkawi Self-Defense and Pilsung Taekwondo. From London, he is Shaquille the Winter Soldier. Mia. <laughs> Standing across the cage in the red corner, representing ultimate athlete from Luton, he is Farzan Bad Intentions. The referee, Sam Amin. Our referee to open to both fighters, giving them their last instructions before they go to battle. Guys. Guys, Can't be got this Off they go. Touch gloves, both fighters. Snappy kick there by Fazan Khan. Straight away, you can see that Fazan's really light on his feet compared to. Oh, head kick there straight to the face. I think Fazan actually, he realised straight away, you know, he said his apologies. Um, obviously, these guys, you know, the adrenaline is pumping, and you know they, they're just here to do battle. But you know, as with all the MMA fights, there is no headshots, and you know um, now Shaquille seems to be have he seems to have like some time to recover there now. Absolutely, I mean, even though it's a no head sh head shot show, you should still keep your hands up, and this is what coaches will be telling the fighters because anything can happen. I mean, like you said, the adrenaline is rushing, rushing, you know, the motions, you can get carried away. Yeah, and this is what amateur, uh, amateur MMA is all about, you know. It's all down to experience. Because uh, you know, I'm very humble. Uh, He's on his very, very quick leg kicks. I'm very confident. Yeah, I mean, lovely. I don't know what that was, Charles, but it was a flying something. Spinning back kick, flying. 
It's lovely to see this, you know. Uh, he's, he's athletes, young athletes, uh, acrobatic. Great combination. Yeah. Yeah. Shakira's coming straight in, you know, with he throwing heavy leather there. Oh, lovely outside right yeah. from him. He looks, he looks really loose and sort of like. It just kind of reminds me of a Conor McGregor, you know, with his stance and the bouncing. And he's, he's a very confident man. Okay, so I don't know if that was a low blow there by Shaquille. I mean, Fazan's definitely keeping Shaquille guessing there. Yeah, I think it's the, the speed of the kicks that are coming through Zabe. You know, Shaquille really needs to sort of check some kicks, you know, uh, get some lateral movement going. I'm loving the confidence for Zahn's got here. Showed him that cocking that right hand and, and you know, coming forward. Again, lovely, lovely outside left kick there. Very quick kick there by Fazan Khan. You know, Shaquille Mia, you know, he's, he's getting the old kick and punch and punch punches in as well. He catches a leg kick there. Beautiful sweep to take it to the floor. Okay. Shaquille going for ground and pound, listening to his cornerman, but I don't think this is going to do much because Fazan's just looking at him, thinking, well, is that all you've got? He's actually nodding his head. Yeah. I love it. I mean, he's got out there nice and easy there, Fazan. Yeah, I mean, Fazan uh, was never in trouble there. Shaquille did great to sort of catch the kick and get the take there. I mean, they scored well there. I mean, that left outside uh, leg of uh, Shaquille is taking a big batch at the moment. Yeah, Shaquille really needs to sort of set his legs and you know his hands up with his legs, um, get the good range going. And, you know he really needs to turn his hip into the kick. Um, he's throwing straight leg kicks, and you know he really needs to put his waist and his leg and really turn the hip into the kicks. Exactly how uh, Fazan is doing at the minute. I mean, Fazan looks like the better striker clearly on the feet, but I mean it's not it's not deterring Shaquille because he's still coming forward. Yeah, so far, you know, it's, it's a bit clear the striking game is 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 you know, definitely being won by Khan there. Okay, that's the end of the first yeah! round. Fires touch gloves and off they go. Nice, yeah, Shaquille. The Muay Thai stance here from Khan nice, clearly relax, showing relax, that you know, he's, he's not messing around, you know. He's, he's going to time his shots. Oi. It's pretty high, yeah, you should just be careful with those uh, high kicks there, for Zahn. Yeah, I think the, you know, he, I mean, you don't want to catch uh, your opponent's knee either. But else, Shaquille seems like he's in a bit of pain there, but he's nods his head, he's ready to carry on. I think he's hitting a lot of leg kicks, lovely hand and leg combinations there by Khan. And again, heavy, heavy leg kicks. Absolutely, the left leg of uh, Shaquille has taken an absolute hammer. Oh, and again, I'm not sure how many more kicks Shaquille can take on. He seems like he's struggling to sort of balance on that foot at the minute, that lead leg. I mean, he's so evasive as well, because um, he's coming in and out, he's you know, throwing the combination well, and he's out. That's right, but the problem is there's no balance left there. And again, he's caught the kick, but what can he do with it? Is he, he's, oh. he successfully gets the takedown, he's straight into side, almost into side control. He needs to be heavy on top, and now he's actually successfully got the side control there. 
he did take his time here as well. Well, actually, I don't know. He's in a good position for a head and arm choke there, but he's moved straight into map position as that was a bit. He's in the wrong side for the head and arm choke. I think he needs to get his hips on the other side. But... Yeah, well, he's, actually, he's actually lost that now because he's not got enough pressure there, but Fazan pulls guard. You can see Shakur's really tired here. He's breathing heavy and those punches are coming on really slowly. Yeah. Lovely pressure right there. Again, explosive for Zion staying out of that position out of trouble. You know, stalking his man is Fazan Khan from Luton. Again, another, he's caught another kick. Fazan really needs to spring those kicks back. They're coming in with a lot of power, but they're not springing back quick enough. Maybe that's because the as the rounds have gone on a little. He probably needs to mix those kicks up as well. He's trying that right leg leg high kick quite a bit, so he's waiting for it. Probably two or three other kicks. Again, Shakir's caught a kick again. Because I really needs to start. I mean, Svan's breathing quite heavily himself now. Um, you know, he, need, he needs to start mixing the hands up with the legs and maybe you know mix on some of his strikes up with some takedowns maybe. Because uh, you know, Shakir's not really got enough. He's not really like balancing well enough on that front leg, so it's an ideal opportunity to take that taken down. Absolutely, killing instinct. I think Shakur looks hurt, he's backing off, and it's an opportunity for Kazama to finish the fight. And he's showboating here, but he needs to finish that fight. I mean, that can work in C class of MMA. I'm not sure about in pro MMA. <laughs> Beautiful body shot there. By Khan, heavy level throw. Shaquille's not backing off, you know, he's throwing punches straight back. And we're at the end of the second round, there's been great, great round again. Shaquille seems like he's gone down, seems like he's in pain. I'm not sure what the referee Sam Ahmed is saying to him, but he's asking him. He does look hurt, I think there is something not right, because, yeah. I mean, he's holding his shoulder at the moment. But again, what I, what I mean, the first two rounds, I've got to say, are quite clearly for Zahn's here. What do you, what do you think? Yeah, oh, 100%. Got the, I mean, he's, he's, yeah. he's won the stand-up battle for sure. I mean, uh, she can't and the fight's over. The oh, it's over. Yeah, the referees waved the fight off. And uh, we have a champion in uh, so, excuse me, we have a winner for Zahn Khan from the Ultimate Athlete Gym in Luton. Uh, completely dominated the round. Unfortunately, Shaquille Mia from al Qawi Self-Defense uh, was unable to continue due to an injury. Um, I like to. See, I hope he's okay. Um, great sportsmanship shown there by uh, all involved. Um, yeah, and um, yes, yeah, that's, that's another fight over. Probably not the best way you want to win a fight, but again, it was down to down to the striking prowess of Fazan Khan. And again, a lot of respect showed there between the both the camps. Of course, you know, you know, uh, Fazan did enough. You know, he dominated with the leg kicks. Uh, you know, in the striking department. And yeah, you know, I'm sure he's very happy with the win. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a winner! By way of referee stoppage and the, his opponent being unable to continue, please give it up for your winner, Farzan. Bad intentions! Khan! The ultimate athlete, Jim. And another stoppage in the MMA bout so far, so it's... It's Excellent. going well at the moment, isn't it, Shah? Yeah, no, great work. Uh, you know, another finish, and this is what the fans want to see.